I'm confused. Wait. I have to go back here, don't I? Oh my god! Alright, boys, what's going on? Today I'm playing a Mario Kart map, and this actually looks really interesting. Okay, so I would assume that's a soul box. Wait, timed gameplay or normal mode? Oh, we're going timed. Hey, Mario. Oh my, oh, what the hell? He's so fast, dude. These are such big zombie models. Holy shit. Right, as always, if you enjoy any of my videos, please consider leaving a like, subscribing. I'd really appreciate the support. Okay, wait, now that I'm kind of doing all this, okay, there's Pack-A-Punch, but where is a weapon? need three hammers to open the door do i actually have to buy these oh my 3500 is there not a weapon down here wait the strife's still doing enough i guess you know this is actually a game i haven't played forever is mario kart dude used to play it all the time on the wii i actually had like you know one of the little wheels where you actually put the wii remote in actually i'm gonna quick right real quick we had one of the wheels where you actually put the wii remote in so it actually felt like you know a little more immersive i guess what hammer 750 points okay well i just spent 750 points oh i was gonna say i just spent 750 points but i don't have a weapon yet but i got a weapon it's all fine i have a gks which is nothing to brag about but it's a weapon but dude i miss mario kart like i feel like that's one of the two games everyone's played i feel like everyone's played mario kart and everyone's played minecraft i couldn't think of what it was yeah minecraft Oh, there's an MP7 over there. Oh, and then I have the GKS. I didn't see that as I ran by. Yeah, but I feel like it's true that Mario Kart and Minecraft are like the only two games that like everyone has played. Like by everyone, I mean 30 and under. Cause you know, we're not gonna count people who like never really grew up with games. So just never got into games at all. I'm talking like people who have had computers that like have come out while they were young, you know, like that kind of age. So that's why I said like from as young as whatever to 30, which honestly, I miss Mario Kart. It's really fun, but I just hate how luck dependent it is. Like seriously, the power-ups can like, you know, you can be in sixth to get a bullet bill for some reason and then just win the race just because you got a lucky power-up. And then the same the other way, which is like, if you get hit with too many power-ups, like, you know, get blue shelled. Oh yeah, you led the entire race, but now you just finish in like fifth. And it's like, well, I did really well and I can't do anything about a blue shell. Oh, shit okay where is another soul box to fill okay not over there Just keep sliding okay here's another one but yeah i really do like mario kart i guess i've just never been too big of a fan of like luck dependency in games like i like video games to kind of be a skill-based thing i'm just a very competitive person so i think that just makes sense okay wait i need another weapon because my gks is out of ammo i mean i could just get another oh god is that an fmg9 hold on i want that that's an fmg9 excuse me I could just buy GKS ammo, but I need two weapons anyway. Oh, it is so many memories using this uninfected dude. I mean, yeah, you know, uninfected, it was a Kimbo, which was just insane, dude. If you remember that, oh my God. On MP, like even like not infected, just like TDM, Dom, people that melt you with FMG9 Akimbos, dude, those things were insane. It's not actually doing too great right now. It could be worse. Okay, I think I filled that up. We'll just kind of keep going, I guess. So I assume there's one there and then one across. Actually, can I have an in plain sight? I'd actually appreciate that just in case I need it. Anywhere, that's also just completely fine. Escape gums are great to have. I need to go up top as soon as possible. I have 10k points. Holy shit, I'm rich. I'm rich in the Mario Kart world. Oh my god, this is getting a little sketchy. I missed my slide, how? I didn't miss my slide, the slide missed me. Okay, this one should be almost done and then I can run down to the other end. Okay, I do see one. It is done. Um, no, I don't want the nuke, that slows things down. I think this is an ammo machine right here. It... Oh wait, Wonder Fist 2.0. Oh, I did do time gameplay, so I can't say if a zombie is Luigi t in over there. Oh my god, he is. So I've had a PC for two years, I believe. That is one thing I've never played but watched so much of on YouTube is I've never played G mod the reason i kind of just titrated into that was um you know t-posing yeah i never played gmod i watched so much gmod on youtube like hide and seek oh it's so good prop hunt obviously i wasn't a big fan of sandbox i really liked hide and seek and prop hunt and those are also the better days of youtube okay let me go up top okay there's a buildable table there's a mystery box come on give me that give me the box of mystery i don't want the gks i'll take whatever it is except for okay no, this is good i said except for because i was ready to just get mad about whatever it was wait is power on? Oh, I can't. Oh, shit. Well, it looks like I'm not taking much advantage of this insta kill because I'm an idiot. Wait, all right, we're good. Now we're good. Come on, zombies, get over here. I want to take advantage of the insta. You guys need to quit freaking out. I'm literally fine. I'm I'm good. I'm chilling. I know what I'm doing. Absolutely no faith in me. Okay, we got to make sure we get all the perks. Speed, yes. Uh, there's the ones I wanted. Double and then stam. Let me through. I don't die on these. I'm fine. I don't die on these. Oh, hammer. Actually, I should probably, like, focus on getting Pack Punch open, too. Where's the third hammer? Okay, give me Stam. 
Let me get that max ammo. Uh, okay, we're fine. Okay, let me do this one real quick, though. What's that buildable? I haven't found any parts, so I don't understand what the buildable could be. Maybe there's, like, three shield parts on the top level that I haven't gotten to yet. But how do you guys feel about Mario Kart? Like, share your best Mario Kart memories. Uh, I don't know if I have, like, a best memory. I do have a million memories of being on Coconut Mall and coming on that, like, last little um turn. You know, this is back on the Wii, and this is, like, when the Miis were in the cars that were moving, you know? I have so many memories of losing on that last turn because I ran into the damn stupid stupid cars oh, there's more up here okay that's one shield part okay third hammer you have all the hammers cool i kind of figured that one out already all right um i'm actually gonna keep these two weapons i have you know what i really want to see if i get akimbo here give me the akimbo give me the akimbo please oh dude please yes this camo is sick look at this it's like like bloody if you know what i'm saying like you know what i'm saying when i say that like see how like that back red part's kind of like almost like crystallized it's like frozen blood but like look at that that's so cool what perks do i want to not mess with yet i don't want widows widows kind of just messes with me i don't have enough for any perks oh uh, i just packed much both my weapons duh i was like where'd all my points go well, you just spent 10k on Pack Punch, so pr probably there. Oh, I think I finished that one. I can't tell because of all the Mario bodies. Wait, what is this perk over here? Just asking. Uh, Mad Guys Moonshine, I don't know what that does. If anyone knows what it does, please tell me. Because I don't know what half the, like, custom perks do. I know, like, what Bull Ice Blast does. Bull Ice Blast is basically just Widow's Wine. Actually, no, it's basically just Winner's Whale. Uh, Banana Colada, I know what that does. Don't know what Mad Guys Moonshine does. Uh, I just found out what Fighter's Fizz does thanks to someone who watched my video. I found that out on my last video that you you guys saw okay i'm saying that and i really hope i remember to upload things in the correct order so if i mess it up it's gonna be on the video where it's the 27 perk map yet again i just i sh i'm gonna try to mark it down to make sure i upload in the right order because i hate referencing past videos and then like not remembering what order i recorded it in by the way I'm so mad that game just ended how it did. Like, I literally, like, the weapon I had couldn't kill the zombies. Like, I would put multiple clips into zombies and they wouldn't die. And then, like, the gun game thing broke. All a very unfortunate map. It, uh, it was a fun map until then. I was really enjoying the map. Is there any more? Oh, no, there's another soul box over here. I thought I already killed this one. Oh, wait, no. I ran by Widow's Wine. I was like, I don't want this. I'm going to get Cherry. And then I remembered that I didn't have enough. Oh, my God, that sound. I think that's the sound of me picking up the Vulture's Aid ammo things. It's so loud. Oh, my God, it's so loud. Vulture's Aid, why are you doing this? That's insane. Oh my god. Okay, Souls Complete. Claim your reward in the spawn. Find the stars. Oh, in the spawn. Oh, wait, I see a star. One of 13. Where's my reward? Wait. What is this? Oh, this is the... Ew. Ew, it's a PO4 ICR. Oh, the hell. Okay, hold on real quick. Oh, I just shot a star by accident. I'm just trying to fight to the Wonder Fizz I perk I just bought. What did I get? Just give it to me. Okay, now that I have an insta-kill, I want to sit here and get all the perks to... Please, Vulture's Aid, stop. The viewers have eardrums. I don't care about... Take... Uh, did I say unidentified or undefined? Undef it said undefined, I believe. It's Snail Space Slurpee. Okay. Bull Ice Blast. Yeah, we're just gonna sit here and take all the perks. Okay, I still need to find the stars once I get all the perks. Another undefined. Who's Who, which just went in the bottom slot instead of finishing the top row. I, dude, I don't know what's going on. I've been playing a lot of maps lately. They have a lot of perks. How many more do I need? I can't even tell how many I have because there's too many zombies. Uh, 12, 17. Oh, there we go. Okay, hold on. How many do I have? Oh, I have all the perks. So is there 18? Okay, yeah, I counted 18. Okay. The stars. I need to find the stars. Um, oh, I see one over there. Wow, I just snapped on him with dead shot. Dude, oh my, I can't. Uh, duh, oh, I'm aiming at everything. Okay, I see more. I thought that Mario's head down there, that big yellow shit was a star. Oh, there's one. All right. Oh, I see that one. Clip it. Nice. I see another one. Ah, no, I wanted to stay up top. Stupid zombies. Okay, this reminds me of Plants vs. Zombies. Another good game, dude. I played that a lot on my phone in school when I was younger, but you know what's better than that one? Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare, the one that came out a few years ago. I think a second one came out, but dude, the first Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare was my favorite game for the longest time. It was so good. Who's played it? Because you actually, like, unlocked chests and shit. I don't remember how exactly it was. It was, like, it was packs. It was card packs. And you got, like, different variants of, like, pea shooters and all that. And, like, it's... For those of you who don't know, it was, like, a third-person shooter with Plants vs. Zombie characters. There are different types of zombies. There's, like, a line backer guy ah oh, dude it was such a good game who's played it please tell me someone's played it i know they came out with the second one well, actually i don't know i'm pretty sure but i didn't get it but the first one was so fun because like the progression was so good because you could like do things to earn the better variance characters it wasn't like aw where it was like purely luck based like you could like do things to earn the ability to like craft these better characters it's so damn good i missed that game i need one more star by the way is it like on top of the flag i could feel like that's no okay I found a couple on like this outskirt edge should i 
Actually, let me run the perimeter real quick. Oh. Okay, now what? Game? Don't understand. What do I do now? Oh, wait. Here's the air shield part. I'm an idiot, dude. It was right here. When's the last time I've actually killed these zombies? I think I've run around for like two or three minutes without killing zombies. Grab star. Whoa. You need to do all the rituals. What? I've already filled like 12 soul boxes, found like 13 stars. What are these rituals, baby Bowser? This is a soul box. It's not a soul box. What do I do? What do you mean? That's not a soul box. Oh, it's not a soul box, so I have no clue what to do. I mean, that's how custom zombies works. If it's not a soul box, the game's screwed. Wait. Spawn continuous. What? Oh, I'm like actually stuck in here. Hmm. So the rituals actually like you activate the ritual and then have to be stuck in here. I'm stuck in here, zombies. Stop. You're taking advantage of me because I'm vulnerable. I hate this box. This box sucks. <laughs> wait. It just tells me to wait. Not telling me what to do. How many are there? Are there really four of these? Oh my. These take so long. It's like actually like a two minute ritual. Are you kidding me? Oh, uh, Max. Max ammo, please. Game. I want that. Oh, it's done. Oh. Can I have max ammo, like, for free? Dude, you're kidding me that I have to do more of these. <sighs> what if I just train him up? Like, what if I just don't shoot him and actually just get him in the train? It didn't tell me I needed to kill him. It just said wait, so... Because now I have all 24 zombies, so I think I can just sit here for two minutes and do this. I have outsmarted the game. Hold on, I need to get rid of these. Get rid of the widow's wine nades. Get rid of the, 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 the widow's wine nades. Dude, the fact that there's, like, a whole horde of 24, like, zombies that are three times the size of a normal zombie is just terrifying. Like, Look at this shit. The zombies usually never tower over you. <laughs> oh my god. And again, it still just says wait, right? Okay, I can't get back to the box. Yep, wait, dot, dot. They're despawning and starting to respawn. What? What are you... You're not part of the crowd. Oh yeah, see? That's all I had to do. Oh no. All right, two more of these and then I'm chill. Actually, I say I'm chill, but I thought that the stars were actually gonna be the end of it. I remember I talked about this game a while back, but Gotham City Impostors. Dude, that game and Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare were two shooter games that like weren't talked about enough. They were so good, dude. Both of those games were so good. Honestly, I think Plants vs. Zombies Garden Warfare, the first like three or four months that game came out, I literally shit you not. I, you're not gonna believe me. I think that was the most fun time period I've ever had on a game. Like, I had more fun on there than I did on, like, Call of Duty launch weekend. Like, the first couple months that game was out because there was so much to grind for. You could have, like, a fiery pea shooter, you could have an ice pea shooter, and then there's four or five characters on each side. There was the plants, and then there's zombies, and there was just so much to grind for. And then you could just change your kind of you could play if you want to play pea shooter you could play like different ones you could just change if you wanted to play the sniper zombie there were different ones that had different abilities and then uh gotham city imposters was just such a fun game too man that's crazy to say i literally do think that as much fun as i've had on call of duty launch weekends over the years nothing ever really eclipsed what i found in uh planes for zombies garden warfare that's just so weird to say and like i'm not just saying that to like, like be like oh my like what really you have a call of duty zombies youtube channel but it wasn't like you know this is, this is my favorite game okay let's say that before you go like oh yeah this is your favorite game why don't you go like why haven't you thought about doing that i mean like i said i really enjoyed the game and then i just i don't remember why i stopped playing this like cod zombies is my favorite game it's the only game i've played for a decade and not got tired of you know i've had 10 years of fun on this game but that like three month period when I first got that, you know, PVZ Garden Warfare, I just don't think I've ever had more fun on a game. Like, it was, like, this, like, three-month condensed super fun time. Okay, this one's probably, like, halfway done, and then I need to see what I do next. Another video plug, well, mid-video plug. If you've watched up to this point, please consider dropping a like. It really helps the algorithm, and it makes me happy to see that you guys actually enjoy the content I'm putting out. And if you're watching to this point, you're not subscribed, subscribe that also helps me out you might not like that i'm plugging myself but it's my video so i'm gonna plug myself please tell me that's the last one by the way i'm confused wait i have to go back here don't i oh my god unlock bible ending oh, duh, oh. <laughs> what the oh my god <laughs> where's the bible ending why are there hellhounds oh this is sick like a map event change there's hellhounds now where's the bible ending i don't even know where it is do i actually have to like play and unlock it at a certain point like kind of have to kill enough zombies in this hell state i am confused on where wait it's probably here idiot 50k okay oh okay okay let's get rid of these why am I getting random points? Do you see what's going on on my screen? Look how many points I'm getting randomly. Oh, wait, how are the Widow's Nades hitting over there? Okay, I need all Widow's Nades to stop because I need to, like, exact change it and I don't want it to go over. 50k exact change, lads, come on. I'm still getting random points. Okay, is it done? 
It's almost done. Oh, hold on, wait. I can just get rid of the... Okay, so any zombie affected by Widow's Nades is now just gone. I don't want to go spend 4,500. Actually, I don't need to spend 4,500. Hold on, let me just... Uh, weapon, 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 weapon. Oh, wait. No, no, no. That's probably... No, 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 no. Stay away from there. Stay away from there. That's probably what's giving me random points. Okay, that's the FMG9. But buy the S-Cargo. Yep. Oh, my. I can't wait to buy the S-Cargo. Just give it to me. Come on. Oh. Uh, oh, I bought, no, I didn't want to trade that out. I have no ammo. Nuke. Give me the S-Cargo. Whatever. Oh. Okay. <laughs> now I get that. Oh, I have Mule Kick. I hate Mule Kick. Okay, well, I guess I didn't trade away a weapon. I just bought it and forgot I had it. End of the game with the S-Cargo, boys. So we're getting random points for shit. You see that? How am I supposed to get exact change when I'm getting, like, this kind of random ass points? Okay, hold on, wait. Hey, look, these the random points are still going. Okay, I don't know if I'm going to get exact change because I'm just, like, infinitely getting points. Please stop. Please stop getting points. Why am I still getting points? Stop. Stop. Stop wanting these guys change. You ass. You're so shitty. Which one's being stupid? Okay, I'm 40 points over. Okay, how much is that cargo ammo? I don't even know. Like 750? Where can you guess 750? No, I'm getting random points again now. Like, what am I supposed to do about this? Like, what's causing random points? Oh, it's the vultures they'd missed. All right, screw exact change. It's just not happening. I, I'm just getting random points. I know why I'm shooting them. All right, if you enjoyed this video, please consider leaving a like, subscribe, and thank you all so much for watching. This is actually a really fun map, and I'll catch you in the next one.